Hello everybody, my name is Thallion and welcome back to Dark Souls. Wait, 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 no, this is the wrong elevator. This is the wrong elevator. That's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do. This was, no, oh, this was ill-planned. Okay. You know, I cut that, cut that now. We're done, we're done. We're, we're starting this over. Hello everybody and welcome to Dark Souls 3. This was what I meant to do because I thought that elevator went somewhere else, but apparently I was wrong and crazy and all kinds of wrong. So... This, I don't know what you're talking about. We didn't start this episode before four seconds ago, but for real Thank you for watching and welcome back to Dark Souls 3 and I'm excited to get back into it. Bean pole required ahead Therefore no fatty ahead. Okay. Um, I actually don't know how to get back up. Where the hell am I? Oh That's a little secret area by where the crystal guy was. Okay So now we're gonna go back up and we're going to explore more of the cathedral proper and I'm really excited because I think we're getting pretty close to the boss and I know there's a lot of secrets here and I'm really excited to just like go through and kick some fucking ass. So hopefully we'll get to see the boss of this area soon. Okay, we should be getting back close to where I fought the big knight before. Yeah, there he is. Hey, buddy. Hey there. Okay, so there's another giant over here and I want to look at what I can explore. I can go over here. It looks like... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, Joe. Little Joe. Little Joe, what are you doing that for, Little Joe? Don't you mess with me. Don't you mess with me. Okay, so let's see over here. I want to make sure I explore everything that I can because I imagine that this place has some crazy secrets. Did I already, have I already been here? I've already been here. Okay, never mind. Looks like we're going the right way. Well, let's go towards the second giant where I will kill him. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hey, you so, you think you're big? Oh, you, you are kind of big. It's okay. Oh god, there's a goo. There's a gooper. There's a gooper goo. Okay, how am I kill? Oh god, I don't do shit for health towards you. Oh, I should go back to using a bow. Oh, I'm gonna go back to- What the fuck? Why are you just climbing on walls and shit, you gross motherfucker? Oh! Uh, that was bad. That was bad. Hey, 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 giant. Giant, hey, hey. What the fuck is that? Don't shoot. Oh, I don't have a- I don't have a thing to do. Oh, you know, I bet I know how I can do this. I bet I know. And by I know, oh God, mm, this is gonna be difficult. Stop flinging that mud at me, you jerk. There's so much bullshit. If it was just him, I might be able to take him. I might try to work this ever so slowly and kill these douchebags. That thing is gross. Look, that's grody. That's disgusting. Oh, hey, he took it out. He also took me out. What a douchebag. So I think we can all agree that theoretically I could just run past this giant and probably survive with uh, quite a bit of success. However, that's not how I do things here. That's not how I do things. I'm gonna take this giant down. We're gonna take him down to Funky Town. Funky Town. Can I just, uh, ooh, ooh, I have a triple shot. Wow, that's trash. Come on, hey giant. Yeah, now I can shoot you. Boom, yeah, now you do real damage. Now you do real damage and I can kill you. Even though that legitimately takes way too much. Oh, now you're gonna regen. You know what, fuck it. We're doing this good old fashioned sword and board. Sword and board Aruno. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, giant lord. Just, just stay under your feet, you're a boss now. You're gonna be relegated to boss town. Oh, 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 no. I don't wanna be directly under your feet, you know where you can stomp me to death, but we're finishing this. We're finishing this so oh, fucking fast and furious way. I don't even know how close I am to, to killing you. Ooh. Let me just power attack. How close are you to dead? Huh? Okay, so with the inability to roll properly kind of sucks. Oh, there's a, oh no, oh no, 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 the little slimers. The slimers are nearby, fuck. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Oh, you're almost dead, you're almost dead. Sweet, I can see your health now. Let me just, one more, whoosh. Wait, you're not dead? No, oh, oh, I had lock on on, my bad, my bad. Yeah, yeah, you weren't so tough. He, weren't, he wasn't so tough. Heck yeah. Oh, you did, son. Drink, oh God, oh, these things, I don't like these things very much. Oh, I don't like them at all, they're bad. Let me just collect all these items, drain gauntlets. I don't know what the drang are. So that might be a, ooh, a large tiny shard, ooh. But that might be a mistake on my part, lore-wise. I'll probably end up reading those items later on and getting a better idea of who the Drang are. Pale-tongued. You get pale tongues also from killing Dark Race. So I know I can go up there, but I have a feeling that that's the way that you progress the story. I want to check out the other side real quick. But pale tongues, you get them from Dark Race, and they're part of, I think, the Dark Moon. Ooh, that's a weapon. Uh, part of the Dark Moon Blades clan. 
which I also part of actually the covenant. So fun fact there, but I don't know. They, they have cool hammers though. They have cool hammer bros though. Okay. So I'm just going to head on through here and hopefully see, Oh, this isn't a doorway. I thought it was a doorway. Huh? Let me just pull this lever, which probably will end. Okay. Ha no, don't lock me in here. Don't. Oh, Oh, what? Is that a bridge or is it a gate? Or I'm just gonna sneak through here. Okay, it would have let me out anyway. Weird. I don't really see a good use for that unless like it's supposed to be when I get up there. I don't know. Maybe I was supposed to do that before I went up there. Huh? I don't know. Wish I could drain this mud. I just love having mud all over my face. Just all over my body, swimming in mud. Just, oh, mud all over my taint. Just ignore that last part. I don't know why I said that. Oh, man, no, I should not even be coming in contact with the mud. That's a biggin. Oh, that's a biggin over there. Oh, and there's, like, little bros. Okay, I got a plan to take care of the biggin. Because he's got that, mm, that, that mighty sword. Oh, fire! Hey, come over here, buddy. Buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hey, you buddy. Hey, fire bro. Oh, hey, knife of destiny. Huh, it is nice to meet you. These guys have like no help. Those throwing knives are actually surprisingly effective. Like they do a decent amount of damage for being throwing knives. Oh, that's, that looks like a big old knife. Are they like praying for retribution? Hey buddy. Oh, now you see me. Oh, I thought, oh, you got a big hit. You got a big hit. You have a big sword, mister. Oh my, fuck me. Oh. Oh, I have my bow, so I have my shit roll. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, I forgot I have the shit roll. I need to up my equip load slightly because I would love to be able to carry around my bow permanently just in case I need it, like for the giant or anything. I can pull it out really quickly. I don't I, I don't trust you, so, uh, I, oh, kuchka! Oh, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Oh, oh, oh. oh you tricksy motherfucker. Oh, I guess he wasn't really being all that tricksy. Kill all these guys, too. I guess he really wasn't being all that tricksy. I just kind of invaded him while he was praying and killed him. So, man, I'm a douche. Huh. This looks like it's a good way to a boss arena over here. So I'm going to explore this. What was that? What was that? Oh, hey. Hey, fire, bro. Catch yourself on fire. I don't know why I hit you if I wanted you to catch yourself on fire. But, uh, oh, is this a shortcut down to a bonfire? That would be convenient. That would be very convenient, actually. This is going up. That's the opposite direction than the one I wanted to go. There's a blood stain here. I sh I'm just gonna drink this, Estes. Don't mind me. What do we got? What do we got over here? Oh, big door! Big door! Where do you open to? Hopefully somewhere nice. Hopefully somewhere nice, like on Orlando, before the bad things happen on Orlando. Oh, man. So how many of you people uh, that are watching right now you people. What do you mean, you people? I'm sorry, I didn't mean anything bad. But, uh, but in all seriousness, how many of you guys... Oh, this leads out here, sweet. How many of you guys ha uh, played Dark Souls 1, and how many of you guys found the hidden boss Gwendolyn? Which you can get by... Pl uh, spoilers for Dark Souls 1, by the way. Either by stabbing the Illusion Guinevere, or by using the uh, Dark Seance Ring. How many of you people did that? And I thought it was really interesting. I got the seance ring because I knew what was going to happen beforehand. Um, just because I was trying to go through it really quickly. Try jumping. Fuck you. Um, oh, I think you're... Oh, no. I think they're serious. Oh, no. Wait, wasn't there a bridge that was supposed to be up? That I... Oh, that was over here. Oh, no. Oh, okay. There's a way over here. But I always thought it was really interesting how on our lo Oh, fuck tit balls! Oh, that's a douchey thing to do. Oh. Oh. Hey. Oh, wait. Was this here before? Did I just miss this entire doorway? One second. I need to grab these souls. I'm an idiot. Did I just miss you? Did I walk right by, right by you? Right by you? Sigurd! Well, you look reasonably sane. You're not Sigurd, who are you? I am a knight of Katarina. I've managed to track down this cathedral's store of treasure. It's uh... There, across that narrow part. Okay. Treasure. Hmm. Always so close, yet so far. 
I don't trust you. I'm quite a pickle, <laughs> indeed. Hmm. I don't trust you. Who are you? I know. You're not. I don't, you're not Sigurd. And uh, I don't trust you. You know what? I think I know who you are, but I don't want to make any statements until I've done this. Yeah, this is going to go poorly. This is going to go poorly. Yep. Okay. You're just like fucking patches. I'm betting you this is another patches. Fucking patches. Fucking patches. I knew it. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. You fucking do you, yeah, you you're weird looking. Oh, you're scary. Well, say hello to the nice giant. He adores visitors. It's nice. Wait. Say hello to the nice giant. I already killed the giant! I already killed the giant! Joke's on you, asshole! Joke's on you! Oh man, I'm gonna go up there and I'm gonna stab you really good. I killed him! I love that. I wonder if uh yeah. Have I no shame? I'm gonna go up and mess with him now. But I, I think yeah, that's really funny. I bet his dialogue would have been completely different if I hadn't already come down here and killed the giant. Ah, oh, fuck. Now I gotta deal with these guys. Especially this weird maggot monster. Oh, oh don't you puke on me. Oh, you're gonna puke them maggots. Okay, good. I got the, the that monster out. Now I gotta bait these guys out. But I'm gonna go up there and confront Patches again. I wonder if it's like the first uh, Dark Souls game where you can either kill the crap out of him or forgive him. Which, to be honest, I'm always inclined to kill Patches. Wasn't there a Patches in Bloodborne too? I feel like he's just like a recurring character. Like, not the same Patches, but a different kind of Patches. But either way, I'm gonna go take care of this son of a bitch. Hey, wait. No, I, 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 I lifted the things. Why are they... How do I get back over to you? How, how do I, how do I get over to you? Ah, oh. so I did look this one up. I will admit I looked this one up because I looked all over the place for a freaking lever and couldn't find one. Apparently you have to go through, remember the lift that I found? You have to go through that lift to drop in on him. And I didn't want to miss patches because I don't want to miss NPC dialogues. And I spent way too long looking for it and it was dumb. It was dumb. I got the deep ring. But apparently, and I've only looked up how to start the path to him. So all of this is, uh, oh my god. Please tell me this is the right, whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't roll off, don't roll off. Huh. Okay. Ooh, I hate dropping in this game. But I don't know anything past, like, how to get here, which was the lift that I originally took. Holy fuck, this is like a whole other side of the thing. Oh god, who? Huh. Ah, uh, Joe! Little Joe, what are you doing? Why are you doing this to me, little Joe? Uh... You have a. Ooh, you thought you could kill me, but I have your great axe. Illusionary wall, illusionary wall, illusionary wall. No! There's never an illusionary wall. Never! Illusionary wall, illusionary wall, illusionary wall. No! Oh. Oh, I'm on a weird part of this. So, oh, if I had assumed that this wasn't just a shortcut, I could have taken this road pretty easily. Oh, no, I do not like. Yeah, fall down, fall down, fall down. No, 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 I don't want to fall down, you douche! Oh, you're a cock! Oh! What an asshole! Ooh, <laughs> you tricksy! Oh, you're so tricksy! Okay, I cleared out this entire area up here, making sure that I uh, didn't miss any goodies up here before I go back inside to where the douche knights are! The douche knights of Ondor! Or the Ondor. But, um... Or Londor Bloom, I don't know why I thought that. Oh man, okay. I've gotta be careful up here. They're not as bad as the uh, on Orlando rafters, like as far as their narrowness goes, but I still need to be fairly careful with them so I don't get knocked off by the douche lords. By the douche lords anonymous. Yeah, yeah, heavy strike, whatever, whatever. The whoosh, whoosh, stagger. Oh, I thought you would stagger. Oh, I thought you would stagger. Okay. Oh. And then in the back, yeah. So now I can get whatever goodies are here and then make my way to the asshole who knocked me off in the first place and cost me 10,000 souls. I could probably go back to get those, but it seems like a pain in the ass and I'd rather explore right now. Because like I said, souls right now, I'm not leveling up right now. I'm not gonna level up probably for another two or three zones, probably just two, depending on how difficult things get. But uh, I wanna avoid leveling, oh no. No! Oh! Dodging on rafters is painful. 
Oh no! That was my bad. Can't even blame that on them. Can't even blame that on the other people. It was entirely my bad. I'll take all the blame. I'll take all the blame for it. You know what? Screw these guys. I'm not gonna deal with it. I'm not gonna deal with it. I'm not going to kill them. I'm just gonna go right past them and find whatever I need to find. Wait, is there really? Wait, is there nothing? Oh my god. Oh my god. He's coming for me. He's coming to get my bacon. Illusionary wool? No? Okay. 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 Wait, wait. Can I stab him in the back and then knock him off? No, he's gonna knock me off. Okay. Oh, he rolled. Rolling's dangerous up here. Okay. It's fine, just ask this up. If I take this nice and slowly and then stab him in the guts. Okay, he stabbed me in the guts. No! Why am I rolling? I'm such an idiot! Mm. Okay, I'm gonna take a nice, quieter inventory of what I need to do. Because I know why I'm here. I have a mission. And my mission is to drop down on Hatcheroonie over there. Okay, I think I see where I can do it, though. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Oh, no, that guy sees me. Oh, uh, no. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I hate fighting this guy. Okay. Please don't pull out your thing. I just need to get within target range of you. That's all I need to do. Just target range. Don't pull out your... Oh, no. Wrong thing. Wrong thing. Okay, fuck this guy. You know what? I'm, I'm luring him out over here. I'm luring him into this hallway where at the very least I can fight him bravely and uh, I can actually strafe around him without worrying about falling to my death. Boosh! Like that! See, that is how we do it! And then, uh, slash a do. Oh, fuck, you use your shield. What an asshole! Don't you know that's illegal? That is illegal in this city. And you're dead. Damn. I feel like that one did a lot more damage than the first one. Cathedral Night Helm. Shit! They drop loot that can be looted, and I can get cosmetics from it. I gotta kill all of them now. There is no excuse for not killing every single night now. Shit! Alrighty. But I could just drop down here, nice and quietly. It's right there. I'm pretty sure it's right there. That's my way over. Okay, but there's this douchebag in the way. It's okay. I've got throwing knives. Do as much. Oh. No, no, no. Don't roll. Don't roll. Take the hit. Don't roll. Oh, I need to go this way. I need to go this way. Oh, gotta draw him out like a coward. Like a right proper coward. Because that's what I am. Come on. Is there a guy behind me? Oh, there's a guy behind me. I need to take care of this quickly. Oh, I am in a terrible dis place. Oh, decisions were made and they were bad. No! No! <sighs> I'm having flashbacks to Blight Town. I'm remembering what it was like in Blight Town to fall to my death or to get toxic or to. Just get wrecked by a dog on the way down a ladder and fall to my death. Or to roll right off the banister. Or to get overly poisoned. I, I'm having the flashbacks. I remember. I remember this pain. This hatred. This frustration. This is what I remember from Dark Souls. This is what I remember. Okay, come on. Come on. We're going to do this the old fashioned way. We're going to do this the old fashioned way. Oh, God. Oh, no. Ugh. Don't want to get caught in between everything again. Ugh. Invincibility frames are nice for me and for you. Ow. Not as nice for you, actually. Oh, I, I can't even see what's going on. Oh, I'm dying. I, I'm stuck. I can't move. I couldn't move. It was stuck in between a fucking pillar and the camera was stuck. Fuck. Oh. oh, find the happy place. Find the happy place. Oh. Oh. Come on. Come on, you asshole. Come on, you black knighted asshole. Oh, yeah, I cleared the space out just for you, BB. Come here. Where'd you go? Did you fall off? No, you did not fall off running to me. No, I was going to kill you. I was going to kill you myself, and you have deprived me of that. I'm a little angry, but on the bright side, I should be thankful. I should be thankful. He has given me a gift. And that is the gift of a free ride to Patches. But at the same time, at the same time, I wanted all oh, to kill him with my own hands. Visions of a chance encounter. Okay, so now I can head down to this, I think. Yep. Oh, boom. Ooh. That is quite a bit of fall damage that it makes you take to get over here. 
But it's okay. We're through the rough of it now. The part that made me wanna, what the fuck is this? What kind of weird magey bullshit are you into? Okay, you're dead. You're dead. Patch is my friend. Y yes, hello. Oh, I don't believe we've met. Oh, I'm gonna fucking stab you in the back. I'm Patches. Unbreakable Patches. I'm gonna fucking stab you. You seem to be unkindled. Oh, does he not remember me because I'm you not, uh, embered? Me. You know who I am. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna oh, kill I'm so you. Sorry. That was my hand, as you know. But but the deed, well, that was the armor's doing. Excuse me, motherfucker. You're I want to stab you. Truly. But behold, I'm stripped clean of that unruly attire. Where'd you put it? Where'd you put it? Not a scratch. I'm gonna stab you. Well, that ends well, right? Oh, I hate yeah, you. It's be fine. I can tell. It's that rotten curse. It <laughs> is. <laughs> <have the> <laughs> You put me through this. You put me through this. Frustration. Oh, uh, uh, just a little trick. Yeah, give me everything uh, you have. You should, if you're as Pro, oh, I can actually buy stuff from it. What does he have anything of use? Oh, yes, the Katarina armor. Oh, do I need to buy that to? Well, wait, where's Sigurd? I assume this is Sigurd's armored. Where is he? Where the hell is he? Okay, but I'm gonna buy it because I like the Onion Knight armor. It's really cool. So, oh god, it costs so much. Well, I did, uh, I took the pleasure in taking the, uh, Onionite armor. So now I can look like an Onionite whenever I want. But you, I am so tempted to just stab Patches in the back, but I don't know if he has other things as an NPC. So, I don't know if he has, like, an entire quest line, because that wouldn't surprise me. Oh, hello, you're gross. You're gross. Let me just stab it. Oh, you jerk. You jerk. Ooh. There was a magicker guy. Oh, there's a lot of these fuckers. Oh, there's a lot of them. At least they're pretty weak. But I'm gonna keep Patches alive in case he has something to do uh, with like later quest lines. And if he doesn't, I can come back and kill him later. Oh, fucking maggots. Oh, you maggoties. You maggoty bastards. Okay, I'm gonna back up, get some stamina, let them puke, let them puke their hearts out, and then whoa, fuck. Okay, I, yeah, I can kill two of them with one go in this. There are way too many asshole maggots in this dungeon. Ooh, in this cathedral. Could this be a bonfire? I don't know. Could it? Hi. You don't look too upset with me. Hi. Can I just... Can we talk? You don't want to be mad. Oh, there's a door there. Shit. Okay, let me kill you real quick. Red sign soapstone. I hope you weren't supposed to be a friendly. Maybe you were. I don't know. Anyways, let's go into this door and check this out. Ah, man. I think I've calmed down now. I think shopping through Patches' his inventory and taking a break has really calmed me down. I... Is this the boss? No, there's already a bonfire here. Maybe it's just like a secret NPC. Oh, no, no! It's probably what the guy by the uh, throne told me. Like, Rosaria's fingers or whatnot. Let me just light this bonfire right up. Just, mm -hmm. just light it right up. And rest at it so that I can get my Estus back. Alright, what do we got here? Are you Rosaria? Of Rosaria's fingers? Oh, that's the thorn armor. I have seen some interesting things about the thorn armor. Hey, how you doing, BB? Are you... Are you gonna talk to me? Are you... Could this be a prince? I thought I had a talk option. How do I talk? There was a talk option. Oh. There, yeah, it's only appearing for like... Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Ask to join Covenant? Uh, no. No, I don't know anything about you. Also, from what I understand... Okay, this is something that I actually, like, I remember. I'm gonna come back to this Covenant action. And the reason being, because I browse the Dark Souls 3 Reddit too much, and I happen to know that her Covenant is, uh, not aligned with a certain other character. Um, and I'm already part of the Dark Moon Blades, and I believe it's the Dark Moon Blades where they hate each other. So I'm going to come back after doing a little bit of research and see if I can join them in a certain order because I'm not sure if being in these different covenants locks you out of covenants completely or if you just need to complete certain quest lines before others. Because if that's the case, then I'll just, you know, come back after doing some Dark Moon, Dark Blade Moon, Dark Moon Blade, Dark Moon Blade uh, quest lines. So we might explore Rosaria's Fingers in another episode. Um, I try not to do too much research, but Covenants is one thing I will research to death because they confuse me. 
and I don't like missing out on really interesting plot lines because of one, like, silly mistake of not knowing that they're misaligned, you know? Okay, we're coming back now to where I'm pretty sure the boss is because uh, this is a big open area. It looks like it's leading over to what is, yeah, a big hallway with a throne, and as far as I'm concerned, thrones mean bosses. Like... Completely, unarguably, inarguably, unarguably, is that even a word? Are either of those even words? But thrones mean bosses, and so we're gonna have a good old time. We're gonna fight whatever boss is here. Is, am I already to, um, St. Aldrich? Because St. Aldrich would be, I think they said that he resides in the Cathedral of the Deep, so I guess that would make sense. Time for mob enemy. Good luck, regret. Mob enemy? I've never seen that before a boss. Oh, hi. Uh, you're glowing red, so I'm gonna hit you. <laughs> and I did damage. Okay, well, that's an easy mechanic. Yeah, and I just trade spotties. Okay, simple enough, simple enough. Oh, you're on a big one now. Let me just chop you down. So, yeah, I guess that's how I do damage. Ow, you douche. Oh, man. Luckily, I can take these guys down in pretty easy swipes. So, I can cleave them all down with my claymore. Super, oh, shit. Super easily. And it's gonna trade off to the back. Let me just whoosh. Boom! Oh, I missed. Fuck. Huh. And... Wah! Deacons of the Deep. So this is creepy. There is something really creepy about a shit ton of priests coming after me as, like, a, some sort of weird undead cult. I'm not gonna lie. This is definitely upping it up on the creep factor. Uh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Okay. Oh. Oh, you look different. Are you a pope? Are you ghost pope? Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, whoa. Come on, come on, back it up, take some stamina, take some stamina, and jumping attack! Whoosh! So yeah, I guess this is Ghost Pope. And I'm doing a little bit of damage, it's taking a little bit, I, I know what to do here. Let me just eat a green blossom so I can get my stamina back quicker, because that seems to be my limiting factor here. Uh, ooh, they're like giving you a spirit bomb! Why are they spirit bombing me? Oh no, they're giving me way too much energy for the spirit bomb. Or giving you too much energy. Come on, oh man, back it up, back it up, back it up. S up, S to sup. And then, rushing attack. Even though that does use a lot of sta- Fuck, I missed. That uses a lot of stamina. Ooh. Ooh. Don't you hit me. You're almost dead, you're almost dead. One more hit, yes! Is that it? Is that it? Is there another form? Small doll and souls of the deacons of the deep. Oh. Um. Honestly, that was really easy. That was really easy. Like, I just kind of jumped in there. I mean, I know I'm over leveled, but mechanically that just seemed really simple. They didn't do too much. The The gimmick was pretty simple. Like, it just switched bodies until it got to Ghost Pope. Um, I guess a part of it is I didn't let them complete their spirit bomb attack, because at least that's what it looked like. They all looked like they were channeling energy into Ghost Pope. So, I guess that's it for the Cathedral of the Deep, which is okay with me because I've been recording this for far too long because of all of those fucking frustrating, aggravating, falling deaths. <sighs> Ooh. But, uh, but still, it was a good, uh, Cathedral of the Deep was still fun. It was really massive and huge and grand, which was really cool. But, uh, yeah, so next episode, we're going to be going into the Catacombs of Carthus and seeing where that leads us, because that's the only route that I can see. I don't know what that small doll is. I can only assume that it's a key item that I'll need later. Um, but anyways, thank you, everybody, for watching. If you like this video, share it with your friends, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thallion out! Let me just come over. Oh! That is so cool. He's just like, oh, man. Oh, the slimes are so cute. Look at it. They're so surprised when I go to suck them in. They're like, oh, you chose me. Okay.